Hey gang, Mark Zona with you here. And you know what? If I open this box right here, number one, this box on top says the right box. Well, here's one thing. When I open that up, this is my hook box. And you walk into a store and you look at the wall, you're like, whoa, 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 whoa. There's thousands of hooks, right? I'm gonna go through three hooks right now that I probably use more than an entire wall at a retail store, and it'll get you through a whole season of fishing. Number one is probably the most easy, and that right there is just a little trocar weedless finesse hook, okay? And the great thing about that is for a kid, for a beginner in fishing, if you're walking the banks at a pond or you're fishing shallow, all you have to do is rig a plastic worm or a soft plastic stick worm like that, and you are good to go, okay? The next one, and this is a little bit more advanced, this is gonna be a straight shank flipping hook, okay? Which we see right in that package right there, that Mark Zona package. And the great thing about this, this is more close impact. It's not casting, and all you have to do is rig that bait, take about a quarter inch in, poke it, put it up the collar or the, the top of that bait up on the barb and then bury that hook. And this is more for when you're in really, really heavy vegetation, docks, bushes, really heavy stuff. And last but not least, and this is probably the most versatile hook on the market, is a standard EWG hook. And what does EWG mean? Extra wide gap. And the great thing about this is you can put it into a plastic worm like this, same thing, about a quarter inch, poke it out, spin it around, and then bury that point. And look gang, that will come through anything out there, right? If you don't wanna do that, what makes this probably the most versatile, just like that first hook, that little finesse hook, you could poke it right through the middle, use it as a wacky worm hook. Really, if there was one hook, I would use the most, it would be an EWG. The other thing about this is, uh, the great thing about an EWG, if you are coming through cover and stuff like that, when you have a Texas rig, it will come through anything. But if you look at all the different hooks on the market, a nice little finesse hook, a straight shank flipping hook for real, real heavy cover, and that dude right there, a standard EWG, an extra wide gap offset top right there, guaranteed it can get you through the entire year.